Yeah, I feel I feel good. I'm doing great in this camp for this fight. Juan Juan Chuleta is um, big opponent, but I'm ready for him. That sounds that sounds great. So tell me a little bit about uh, where where have you been training for this particular fight? Um, for this fight, I wanna put a lot of pressure. I wanna keep always my calm for for every round because the calm is very important for 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 the fight for 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 fighter for the fighters. Mm -hmm. But I need to put pressure for. I wanna look in one mistake about. About him, for I wanna try with mission or Traman Pao. I I know how much later have a lot of experience. Okay, had too much fight with um, good fighters, but um, I feel like and, and I feel like more 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 stronger with him. Yes, hello. Oh, I'm sorry. I think we might have. Can you hear me? I would feel like more strong, more strong with him. I, see. him. I see. So uh, tell me, so are you uh, training at uh, AKA? Yes. This time around, course. so in, in, with uh, Coach ha Javier Mendez or someone else at AKA? Uh, Javier, Javier Mendez now is in Abu Dhabi. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, 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 but I was training one one month ago. I was training in in, in San Jose. He after the month moved to uh, uh, Abu Dhabi. I see. I see. Yeah. Are you still so? But are you still in San Jose? Yes. I see. I'm, I'm here. So, so, yeah. so it's not too not too far of a travel to Long Beach uh, for uh, next next week. It's like uh, one hour and a half. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, it's close. I see. So I wanted to ask you because I was looking at your background. You used to be a graphic designer and study architecture. Yes. Yes. Uh, like, like nine or ten years ago, I was studying uh, architecture uh -huh. in Peru, but just for two years because. When uh, I was con I was continue my my career in, in architecture, mm -hmm. but I I get the contract with UFC UFC contract. Sure, yeah. For the reason I move from America, yeah, you know, the, the ultimate you know, fire, yep. fin you know, finish my my career. I Turkey. see, I see. Now tell me now, since you're you 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 did study architecture. In the United States, uh, you've traveled a lot in the, throughout the United States. What city has the best architecture where you visited? Uh, for example, I don't know, understand. Sorry. That's okay. No, for example, the, the question, I, I don't know, understand because. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, what's the best uh, architecture? Uh, city that you've visited? Who has the best buildings? Things like that. Oh, okay, absolutely. Oh, oh here, bro. Here and here and Miami and Singapore. Singapore is the the best city in the world. Oh, uh, <laughs> yes. Very uh, clean, but it's I, too much fancy. Yeah, <laughs> I've never visited, but yes, the architecture does look look very good, very good there. So, uh, now you you, t you talked a little bit about Juan Archuleta. Uh, do you, when you go into fighting your opponent, do you study the opponent or do you focus on what your strategy will be? I have one plan with my team, mm -hmm. okay? Juan Achuleta is tough fighter, but don't have power in the, in the hands because he... Um, a lot of move, move in the in every round. He won't fight it with move a lot, of, a lot. Do less power, no, do, do uh, losing power for in the connect uh, other fighter. Uh, also, do need less more energy, more move, less less energy, 
and less power. I but see. don't uh, how much later don't like it, the pressure. Okay, it's good fighter had moved a lot, mm -hmm. uh, but it's like uh, normally he work like a scramble for skate. But for me, no problem because I will feel like more, 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 more strong. Do you focus on cardio to ensure that you can keep the pressure on your opponents? Absolutely, I feel like I feel more, more cardio. I feel more pressure, but I need to put pressure with more calm, more calm because in my in my last fight, I was I was I was fight like good pressure. But I don't listen in my corner. Oh. I don't listen in my corner because mm -hmm. for one mistake, no one guillotine um, happened in, in my last fight. Yeah, I don't yeah. like it. But I need to put pressure, more kick, high kick, knee. I wanna put like fake, fake, okay. But I wanna put more pressure, but with calm, e focus. I see. And so you you were. You're currently ranked in the bantamweight division, and Arshaleta is ahead of you. If you win, do you feel as though you should jump up into the bantamweight rankings, perhaps maybe a uh, title shot in 2023? Maybe. After this fight? It's hard well, to, yeah. It's hard to. Yeah, uh, yeah. After the fight, I need, to, I need to prove in this fight. If I finish with KO or big submission, maybe I gonna uh, I gonna will have the the big opportunity for the for a title maybe next year, maybe mm. I hope. Yes, yes. Well, you have had a busy busy year. Uh, for this is gonna be your fourth fight in two thousand twenty two. You're very active. Do you like that activity? And then as as far as activity. What have you done to make sure your body stays in shape for for four fights in a year? Excuse me, can you repeat again the question because the the signal is, is, is cut. Oh, sorry, sorry. So you had four fights in a year. How did you do with maintaining your body so you could have your body feel good for four fights in a year? Can you repeat, please? Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, you had four fights in 2022, uh, and how do you maintain your body? How do you make sure your body is in shape, not injured uh, for oh, each okay. fight? Okay, thanks to God, I don't have nothing injury. My body is good. My my brain is good. My face is good. <laughs> <laughs> but I, 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 I don't feel doing good, bro. But thanks to God, I don't have nothing injury. So, if on my body, if on my body, in my mentally, uh, I can continue for a fight. Okay, let's go. Okay, <laughs> so four more fights in two thousand twenty-three. <laughs> yeah, uh, maybe five or four, four or five more. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> That's very good. So yeah. I want to ask you um, for fight week. What do you do to uh, keep your uh, mind, mind and body sharp. You obviously have to weight cut, very important for the fight week, but what do you tend to do? You stay with your team? Do you like watching movies? Do you read? Do you isolate yourself? What do you do for fight week? Always, I try, don't stress in my team, okay? It's, it's very important, have a good team, just for talk, like uh, positive talk, okay? I wanna try, I like, I me, mean, I, I like cook. I like, I like cook because we're, we're more cook, my stress for, for, the, for the five week is down, my stress is down, it's good. I can sleep, I can eat, I like cooking. I like cooking, bro. What's it's your favorite tough. dish you cook? Oh, bro, is now old, bro. <laughs> now old, <laughs> but I like a burger. Yeah, I like a uh, pizza. Yeah. Like a, I, I like a Peruvian food. Of yes, course. everything, bro. Now, 
Excellent. Excellent. Well, Enrique, thank you so much for your time. I greatly appreciate it. We wish you good health, a good weight cut uh, for next week as you uh, face uh, Juan Archuleta Saturday, October 1st as part of Bellator 286 in Long Beach, California. Uh, have a great rest of the day, Enrique. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much, Jason. Okay. Thank have you so a much good day. for the interview. Have a good yes. day, bro. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.